Travis. Go away. Did, uh, did... Did someone just leave here? Jimmy? Your friend. What's wrong? Nothing. I want to be alone. Travis, what are you doing? Leave me alone, okay? God! Hey! What are you doing? No! No! No, I have to do this! Hey! I gotta do this! No, I gotta hey! Stop! Stop! Everything's my fault! It's not your fault! It's not your fault, all right? I can try to tell yes, you. Yes, it no, is! No, it isn't! I'm bad, okay? I've always been bad. I was born I'm bad. bad. That's impossible. I am. I killed. Who? Who did you kill? My mother. She died giving birth to me. I killed her, okay? Why would you think that? My father told me. She wouldn't have died if it weren't for me. Your father's wrong. You hear me? He's lying to you. Why? To excuse what he does to you, what... What he probably did to her. It's not your fault. It's not. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> Hello? Paul, it's Keel. I'm in Medicine Hat. Just a sec. Medicine Hat is a ghost town. There's no reform school, no Jimmy. He's not real. Then who did I see bounding off in the woods an hour ago? Probably Jimmy. Keel. Now listen, Jimmy is Travis's spirit protector. They were fraternal twins. Evie talked to the aunt. Apparently the sheriff beat his wife when she was pregnant. He killed Travis's brother in utero. Wouldn't that have killed Travis, too? No. Fraternal twins have separate amniotic sacs. It's actually possible for one to miscarry and the other to thrive. Jimmy is the spirit of Travis's brother. Yes, and he's killing those who have failed to protect Travis. The minister, the nurse, the guidance counselor. Well, wouldn't he go after the sheriff, too, then? I'm not sure, but I think Travis is somehow preventing it. Where are you? Uh, I'm with Travis. I'm taking him to child services in Derby. All right, we'll meet you there. Paul, look out! I believe I told you to stay away from my son. Are you sure you haven't seen him? Positive. He was bringing in a boy named Travis Prescott. Sorry. Okay, thank you for your time. Shouldn't he have been here by now? Yes. Sheriff. Resisting arrest, attempting to transport a minor Sheriff, outside please. the county. They don't like short eyes in jail, Mr. Kellen. What's your social security number? Listen to me. You need to apologize to Travis. For what? A little discipline? For his mother's death. Come again? Travis yeah. believes that he killed his mother. You need to tell him that's not true. I don't need to tell him anything. You're in real danger otherwise. Are you threatening me? I'm trying to help you. There's a pattern to these killings. They're all people who could have protected Travis and chose not to. Protected him from what? He's a good kid. You need to tell him what you did to her. And you need to tell him what you did to his brother. Before it's too late. I'm beginning to wonder, Mr. Kellen, if your case is even going to trial. Dad, no! Travis? Travis? Come on, son. Come on, son. Wake up. Wake up! Wake up! Who 
were you? Nobody. I went after the others, but I could never go after you. He loved you too much. I had to respect that. Jimmy, you don't have to do this. I'm done respecting that. Take care, little brother. You stood up for him. Thank you. Hard to believe, but I've been where you are. Do you know your aunt very well? Kind of. She's okay. Yeah, she seems nice. I'm, uh, I'm not gonna let you go through this on your own, okay? You call me. Anytime, day or night. Check in on you, deal? Deal. Travis? Hello, Paul. Travis! I'm so glad you're here. Are you all right? Yeah. Everything is gonna be okay. Where did you get this bracelet? friend. Your mother had one just like this. She never took it off. She was buried with it. Let's go.